Hi everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to Sam and Max Beyond Time and Space. We're here at the North Pole at Santa's workshop, and it turns out Santa is a bad guy in this. So we're going to take a look around inside. I just want to speak to the soda poppers first, and then we'll head in and oh, see what's hey, look, going Max, on in there. It's the soda poppers again. We thought you'd all gotten taken out in the Great Dakotan conflict. <laughs> you must be relieved to see we made it. Right. Yeah. Relieved. <laughs> what are you doing here? We all got terrible presents from Santa. Oh, no. So we decided to come to the North Pole and return them. Better that than spending Christmas Eve with a shotgun aimed at the fireplace. Kids today have no respect for tradition, <laughs> Sam. Yeah. Okay, why don't you go inside? Why don't you go inside? We were on our way in when we heard some frightening noises coming from the workshop. It almost sounded like... Gunshots? Yeah. How did you guess? Sam, why am I the only one who associates Christmas with the sound of gunfire? <laughs> Best not to think about it, Max. Yeah, let's not go too far into that, Max. Um, why do uh, no, we know that. What did you get from Santa? What did you get from Santa? A jar full of rhinoceros musk. Yes, another one. <laughs> another one? I got a see-through nighty. It's beautiful, but I don't have the hips for it. <laughs> I'll trade you. Why? What did you get? Tuberculosis! <laughs> oh no. That's what I gave Sam last year. <laughs> and that's why we no longer have a secret Santa at the office. Don't blame you. Max should not be allowed to participate in Secret Santa. Are you still governors? Aren't you guys governors of the Dakotas? We were! But that wasn't enough! So we annexed Nebraska. Oh. Unfortunately, there was a bit of a disagreement. With who? 2.5 million voters! They won! <laughs> Uh, are you going to run again? Are you going to run for re-election? No, now we're focused on environmental issues. Right. We've got a new respect for nature since we got kicked out of the governor's mansion. Can we stay with you guys? No. no. <laughs> they said exactly the same thing. So long. We should be going. Christmas isn't going to save itself. Yeah, not like that snobby, self-sufficient St. Patrick's Day. <laughs> hey, my snowball melted. Oh. So maybe the snowball melts on a timer then. Maybe it's not nothing to do with the... We saw like the little furnace thing on the back of the sleigh last time and I thought it was the heat from that, but I guess not. Uh, right, well, we'll remember that it's here. It means we obviously have to do something with it here or keep it cold, I guess. But we'll head in here and see what the hell is going on with Santa. Why is he sending big robots to try and kill us? Ding dong! Justice calling! <laughs> Oh, look You've at this got place. to help us. He'll kill us all. Now, Max is harmless. <laughs> Not him. Santa. He forced us to make all those awful, hurtful toys. We don't know what's gotten into him. Oh God. <laughs> He's got a gun. Snow will turn red with the blood of the knot. The cartoons right. always made him seem a lot more jolly. <laughs> All right, well, let's have a look around here, shall we? Uh, okay, we've got all sorts of things. A Christmas tree. Let's look at the Christmas tree. It just wouldn't feel like Christmas without the needless destruction of an innocent bystander. <laughs> we've also got this thing, Boxing Betty. It's a Boxing Betty doll. The finest in remote control fisticuffs. Didn't the Mametron teach us anything about the dangers of playing with violent robots? <laughs> nope, I didn't learn anything. <laughs> Good. I worry sometimes. We don't want to learn anything. World's simplest it's maze. The world's simplest maze. What's the big deal? All mazes are simple. Not everybody has your knack for lateral thinking and heavy ordnance, man. <laughs> All right, we got that as well. Uh, can we grab any of these other things? No. What's this switch? Oh, it looks like it stops this toy bomber. Let's have a look at it. Why are we walking all the way over it's here to toy look at it? Bomber. Or a real bomber that just takes tiny warheads. Makes me wish we still had that box of tiny warheads. <laughs> Not me. That was our best fishing trip ever. Oh, dear. Right, we've got a toy bird, bowling pin, cannon, toy guillotine. It's Even very... if the toys were made of wood, this would have been a disappointment. Not the best. Collect all ten. Oh, that's scary. It's one of those infinitely reloading cannons. Nice. Is it loaded? Well, <laughs> yes. It even has the easy light wick. Nice. Oh, well, maybe we can set that on fire. Toy then. Marie Antoinette sold separately. Oh, <laughs> God. Right, so we've got these elves here. What's this? There's a computer with a high score in it. I wonder what the elves have on their office computer. Oh, let's read their email. It's a high score list for Mime Sweeper. Let's see. Prancer, Wiggles. 
shambling corporate presence? How'd that get there? Well, pretty soon it's gonna be all Max. <laughs> now, how do I start a new game? Sorry, I think it's frozen. Hey. Computers and icy Arctic wastelands. A bad combination. <laughs> Now the shambling corporate presence, we heard of that in Save the World, didn't we? When we were in the text adventure in reality 1.5, we had to use the shambling corporate presence for something. So it's interesting that that's come up again. Uh, there's a trampoline. We've got better things to do than jump around on a trampoline. We do? Not really. <laughs> We've got better things to do than jump around on a trampoline. <laughs> Fine. Gift dispenser. This tube spits out presents. Hey, it's just like me! <laughs> I wouldn't call those presents, man. <laughs> there's a computer over here. Oh, the this North must Pole. Be Santa uses to send presents. Okay. Ooh, cougar in a box, assembly required. Uh, Mametron 9000 is out of stock. Obsessomatic stopwatch, it's loud. Uh, foot bath and piranha aquarium, piranhas sold separately. Uh, Grandma's Happy Pills, not in stores, and then my first <coughs> Maui head, new. Uh, okay, can we get any of these things? Cougar in a box. Cougar in a box. <coughs> That's a pretty small box for a cougar. Yeah. Yeah, it says some assembly required. Ew. Now we just need to attach a gift tag. O okay, gift tags. Look, gift tags that say from Santa on them. Perfect. I've had a hard time lately getting people to open packages that say from Max on them. Is that a surprise? You have yourself to blame for that. It was worth it. Yeah. Okay, well, we've got a bunch of gift tags as well. Um, can we... I don't think we need one of those. Okay. We just need to put a gift tag on it to send it. So maybe there's going to be a puzzle where we have to send something specific to somebody. Let's look at the North Pole. <coughs> the North Pole. The magnetic center of the Earth. Magnetism? <laughs> Don't tell me you're one of those kooks. <laughs> believe in magnetism? It's an interesting theory, but I'm not convinced. Oh, but you believe in Your prismatology. Magnetism is a cute bedtime story, but I believe in one thing. <laughs> okay, fine. I guess I can believe in two things, but that's my limit. Yeah, only two things. <laughs> Just got completely attracted to that. Uh, record player. What's this? It's Santa's record player. Do you think it still works? Since we haven't gone near it yet, I assume so. <laughs> okay, don't know if we can use that. Santa's room. Hi, oh. we're collecting guns for tots. Care to make a donation? Uh-oh. Fine, well, I guess not. Torture Me Elmer product testing. <laughs> it's a Torture Me Elmer doll. Look, he comes with his own breakable spirit and detachable retinas. Any likeness to any similar toys is completely accidental. Um, doesn't look like we can do anything else with that. There's some toys over here. Seeing all these toys oh. kind of makes me wish I was a kid again. If it's any consolation, I still think of you as a child. <laughs> Thanks. I wish the courts did. <laughs> oh dear. Oh dear. Okay. What's this? Bop Buddy. It's one of those... Bop Buddy Pre-Adolescent Aggression Management System. One of those things that you pun up, right? Bop Buddy Pre-Adolescent Aggression Management System. Doesn't look like we can use it, though. Flounder Pounder. I wonder why they call this the Flounder Pounder. <laughs> fun. It's quite fun. All right, we've got this slimy crate here. It says to Santa from Lower Manitoba, I think. What is this gelatinous goo? I don't know, but for once, I don't find myself wanting to eat it. There's a mailing label to Santa from Lower Manitoba. Okay, yeah. And they said Santa never gets gifts. What did that say? Say do not crush. I wonder if we have to crush that then somehow. Uh, I tell you what, let's talk to these guys, Elf and Elf. We're trying to talk to Santa. You know him? Mind if I keep cowering? I'd encourage it. <laughs> Just remember to cower with your legs, not your back. Yeah, well, something along those lines. Uh, what's Santa's problem? Any idea why Santa went nuts? Beats me. I'm the intern. I just came off the assembly line yesterday. Right. Jumping jacks and half stacks of hat racks. <laughs> are you saying elves are made in factories? Because if you are, I want to place an order for six million. <laughs> also, tell my army they're fired. <laughs> no, I meant I was working in a factory. Right. Well, that makes a lot more sense. What did the factory make? Elves. Of course. Of course. See anything unusual? 
See anything unusual lately? Well, this morning, I could have sworn I felt the presence of an unspeakable evil. Hmm. Tell us more about this unspeakable evil. I'd rather not speak about it. <laughs> it's unspeakable. <laughs> I wonder if that's to do with that, that corporate presence thing. What are you doing? So what do you do here? I'm supposed to make this tree grow. How? By crying. Christmas trees love elf tears. Ah. Heck, who doesn't? It makes them grow up big and fast. Right. But I'm too darn happy. I'll never be able to cry. What a shame. It's enough to make you cry. <laughs> I wish. Okay, uh, we could make you cry. I bet we could make you cry. Thanks. I've been trying to cry, but I'm just too darn happy. Oh, we can fix that. In fact, that's about the only thing we can fix. <laughs> if you want to make me cry, go ahead. Okay. We want to. We want to. We do. We do. First. Uh, we killed your dog. We killed your dog. Oh, no. Yep, he or she ran right in front of our car, and, well... Squish. I tried to draw you a picture, but I ran out of red crayon. <laughs> that sounds awful, but I don't have a dog. Oh, I know. We got him for you. <laughs> and then we killed him. You like crying yet? Was he a good dog? Oh, yeah. Well, then at least he's in doggy heaven now. Oh, uh, okay, fine. Well, I'll feed, you, I'll feed you to a polar bear. Start crying, or I'm gonna dip you in honey barbecue sauce and throw you to a polar bear. Oh, goody! I love polar bears! Oh. Don't you get it? A polar bear would chop your head off! What? Nothing that cute could be dangerous! Really? Ouch. I didn't think I still had feelings, but there they are! <laughs> I'll rip your eyes out! I'll pluck out your eyeballs and use them as Christmas tree ornaments! Oh, no! Wait! How am I supposed to cry if I don't have any eyes? You could try it. Fair point. See what happens. <laughs> Thanks, but I'd rather keep my eyes. I mean, you got tear ducts still, though, so uh, you can still cry. Uh, I got nothing. We can. Sw uh, you were adopted. Santa isn't real. You're fired. You were adopted. In case no one mentioned this to you yet, you were adopted. Finally, I've been <laughs> living at that orphanage for thirty years. <laughs> it was starting to get pretty awkward. This is tricky. Where are my new parents? Uh, they just died. Oh. Well, easy come, easy go. Oh, it's difficult to make this elf cry. Santa isn't real. You don't still believe in Santa Claus, do you? Sure I do. I saw him this morning. Well, I hate to be the one to break it to you, but uh, Santa isn't real. He's just make-believe. Like the Black Easter Bunny. Or elves. <laughs> but I'm an elf. Yeah. That's what makes this so hard. Wait a second. Are you saying I don't exist? Yeah. Can you prove that you exist? Well, sure. I, I mean, uh, no, I guess I can't. Ouch, a tough break. <laughs> oh, nice. Okay, we did it. Surprise, we were lying. Congratulations, you exist. Nice try, but I don't believe in you either. All right, we did it. So that that's, what's that going to do, make it grow? Apparently. Apparently. <laughs> Oh my god, it's really big now. That's a big honking tree. Those elf tears really work. Okay, um, I mean, can we make it grow bigger? I don't know. Let's speak to this other elf. I'm not We're sure. trying to talk to Santa. You know him? Oh, sure. He's the one who put me in charge here. Was that before or after he went crazy? I'm not sure. When someone offers me a promotion, I don't ask a lot of questions. Okay. I've noticed the watering can there, so maybe we've got to take that. What's wrong with Santa? What happened to Santa? I don't know, but if you ask me, it was only a matter of time before he snapped. Oh, yeah? He's always been a little crazy. Has he? he? has? Think about it. The man gives presents away for free. <laughs> I always assumed he did it for the tax write-off. <laughs> we want to talk to Santa. How do we talk to Santa? I don't think talking is going to do any good. Uh, All he wants to do is shoot everything. That's understandable. <laughs> you gotta get his gun away from him, or he's gonna make us do bad things. Okay, fine. Uh, and where is everybody? Where are all the other elves? Santa fired them. To stay competitive with the other major holidays, we had to outsource our gift manufacturing. How'd the elves take it? They all got together and sang a farewell song. Oh, that's sweet. You didn't hear the song. <laughs> Let's just say it wasn't very Christmassy. Oh, okay. Who makes the toys? Who manufactures the toys now? <clears throat> it's all been moved off-site, so officially speaking, I have no idea. Right. What about unofficially? Baby penguins. 
Uh, baby penguins? Why on earth would you use baby penguins? The adults refuse to work without a health plan. Uh, are the baby penguins any good? Do the baby penguins do good work? Sure, if you don't mind toys that have a slightly fishy smell. <laughs> Giving them or receiving them? <laughs> you can use the gift tube over there and see for yourself. Right, okay. We can use that and see. What's it like living here? What's it like living at the North Pole? I wouldn't know. I can use <laughs> Of course you do. See you later. Merry Christmas. <laughs> don't remind me. If we don't deal with Santa soon, we'll never make our shipping date. Come on, Santa. Right, let's see if we can take this. Well, I can't believe he filled up the entire can. Oh, okay. Yeah, we must have really terrified the poor guy. Good work, little buddy. Oh, stop. <laughs> now you're gonna make me cry. <laughs> so I wonder if we can use that to grow anything else or whether it just works on Christmas trees. I don't know. But guys we are out of time so we're gonna have to try and figure out how to make santa come out of this room or get in there or something in the next one uh really enjoying this so far it's a bit different from save the world um but yes good so as always thank you very much for watching a big thank you to my patrons arcadies games way nate terminally nerdy paul from the phantom fellows lyle barry aldridge hobo and numinous for all the support on the channel i really do appreciate it and i'll see you next time <laughs>